Hi, I trust this finds you well. I hope you've had a good week. What a beautiful day to be outside. I hope you're getting some sun. There's a really interesting dialogue and encounter in this week's parasha, Parashat Vayetze. Yaakov is fleeing from his brother Esav. He's on his way to a place called Haran to meet his uncle Lavan. And on the way, he encounters a group of shepherds standing around a well. They look dejected, complacent. Apparently, they're waiting for some help to remove a large rock that is on the top of the well. They need to feed their sheep. Yaakov approaches them and says, why don't you remove the rock yourself? And they respond with two words, lo nuchal, we simply cannot, it's impossible. So we're waiting for fellow shepherds to bring their herds and together, perhaps we can remove this rock. Yaakov seems puzzled and he walks over to the well and effortlessly removes the rock on the mouth of the well. The commentaries tell us it was as if he was removing a cork from a bottle, it was that simple. And the question is this, Contrast the unbelievable strength of Yaakov and the seeming weakness of the shepherds. Why the difference? And perhaps the answer is two words, words that are often used in the world of psychology, self-efficacy. The shepherds had one look at this rock and they said, nah, there's no way we're going to remove that, that rock. And they didn't even try. Yaakov, on the other hand, has one look on the rock and says, I believe I can do this. I think I can remove this rock. And he walks over to the rock and he removes it. Self-efficacy, self-belief that we look at a situation and we say, I can accomplish this task. I believe in my abilities. How often in life do we come across rocks or boulders and we just write off the situation and we say, nah, there's no way I can accomplish this. Or we can look at it as a pebble, as a cork from a bottle and say, you know what? I can do this. I have the strength within, I have the God-given ability to be able to accomplish this task. Chances are you're going to be able to do it. Shabbat Shalom. Have a wonderful weekend.